Normally I'm not a huge fan of bugs, but for some reason I think moths are pretty cool. They come in so many floofy shapes, sizes, and wing colors, and wing shapes. There's just something awesome about moths. And as a trash panda, I, I know this doesn't- hang on, follow me here, okay? I know it sounds like we're not linked, but I love the night sky. I mean, look at it. Look how pretty the night sky is when you're on a dumpster, and there's so many stars in the sky. It's so pretty. And so when I was recommended by the App Store a game called Flutter Starlight, a game of collecting moths in the starlight, I was like, wait a minute. <coughs> I need that. <coughs> and I have to say the art is absolutely gorgeous. All I see is just cute moths enjoying the night sky because they do the, love them lights. The moths and the lights are just attracted to each other. I just love the moon. And it's a game of collecting cute moths. It doesn't have that many ratings at 606 ratings for 4.7, so it's not a known game, so I don't know much about it. And when we look at the App Store video, you can see that they're just floating moths in a pretty environment. And there's an owl. Do owls eat moths? And there's a moon, and there's mushrooms, and there's cocoons, and I guess these are fireflies. There's a, there's, there's a frog. Frog gonna eat us. So I don't think we're gonna collect a frog. I don't think so. I really do hope this game has music. And in the next video... Okay, there's sound. It's eating, it's sleeping. It became a cocoon. Look how chonky it is. So cute. And now it's a little moth. Okay. Music's pretty mellow, so I'm liking that. Explore a magical forest. I love this design, love the colors. And then it has collect beautiful moths. See, that's what I'm talking, it's so pretty. The moth's wings are so pretty. And then we have unravel mystery. So I guess the owl is a quest person. Nurture real species, no way. I thought this was just aesthetic. Okay, 300 plus amazing moths. There's a, oh wow. And facts, no way. So this game is educational on top of it. So if you're really into bugs, this could be even more interesting if it's actually factual. So I'm pretty excited to try this out because I'm, I love them colors. Another thing I'm really excited about is having you subscribed if you haven't yet done so. Otherwise I will slash you. These are claws made for love. They're not made to hurt anybody. Look on all notifications while you're there to join us during live streams. Let's see what Flutter Starlight has in store for us. This game is about discovering. Okay, you went by too quickly. Dang nabbit. Is there music? Not as far as I can hear yet. Expand your environment by clearing leaves. Okay, we have to select an actual skill. Okay, let's go ahead. Clear to uncover summon. Oh. There's sound effects. Use the incubator to attract eggs you can raise. Okay, attract. Symbols, okay. It is, okay. Eggs take time to incubate. Is this an idle game? Eggs hatch into caterpillars, okay. New species, what are you? Caterpillars need space to grow. Okay, so we need to expand. No, this is to make them into moths. Okay, let's clear. Perfect little homes for your caterpillars. Okay, do we need to move you? Go here. Feeding leaves to caterpillars makes them grow. Okay, wow, this is really, Really, this is a lot going on here. Eat more. Cute. More. Oh, you're growing so fast. Cute. Okay, now it's become pupa. Pupa hatch into pretty moths. Let's see you. Yellow furry legs. Okay. I wonder if that's an actual species. Kitty Edita, is that a real species and does it look similar-esque? Okay, they produce coins over time. Oh my goodness, this is really an idle type game. Keep expanding to discover more. Okay, more foliage. What is this? What is this doing? Collect pollen to level up your moth. What does leveling up do? Oh, we have to make it fly there. Ooh, look at me fly. I'm a moth. Ooh, woo. Okay, there you go. Does it, it actually does the pattern? Look at that. <laughs> okay, I am Matua. Speck of pollen for free. Flowers take time to create pro- There's a lot going on here. Okay, I just want, what do I do? Okay, I just want moths. I don't want a whole RPG going on. All right, so incubator, go ahead. Summon us a new moth. 
This kind of reminds me of the duck game that we played. That was really interesting. It was actually pretty fun. This one has a whole cycle. Look at that. The drawings are so beautiful. But I have to say there's a lot of way too much information going on at the beginning. Okay, we do have the life cycle thing, so we have to remember that at some point. Okay, sparkly means new. Let's go ahead and check you out. All right, so now we're gonna move you over here. We're gonna feed you. Oh, they lied. They made it seem like this was gonna be quick. Oh no, can we hurry? Hurry. There you go. Oh, if we say hurry, it actually takes the butterfly coins. Okay, so now we have to wait for it to turn into a pupa and then it's going to be released as a moth. Oh, let's collect our pollen. Get our money, release the butterfly. Scarlet fodded. That's cute. Okay, now what? Shopping. You have to buy things. Half time for eggs for 12 hours. That's a, that's a limited time. It's not forever. And then you get butterfly coins, wow. You can act, you have to pay money for this game. Oh no, game, what are you doing? What are you doing? This is way too much going on. I don't know if I'm emotionally invested enough to actually pay for this game, but let's get some money. Let's get some pollen. Get your pollen and get out. So the question is, how do we get more eggs? Maximum population reach to attract more eggs. First, fuse or store moths or expand your forest. So how do I do that? Oh, the leaves. I need to... Do this. Okay, let's clear that. Okay. Okay, so we got some more coins over here. Let's get more pollen. Go get it. Go sit. Let's go ahead and incubate a new egg. Is it gonna be a shiny? I think it is. I guess we're waiting for the symbols. Just keep taking the money. It's 22 seconds. So we're gonna wait for that. In the meantime, I'm gonna collect as much coins as I can. And weirdly enough, I just realized there's actually background music. For some reason, it wasn't there up until now, at least for me. But in case you couldn't hear it, here it is. It is definitely cute. Let's hatch our egg. Catch the monies. Stop taking your spot. Oh, we got another one? Okay, let's move you over here. Get the monies. Oh, hello. That's a cute little bug. And I think now we just need to expand. So let's go ahead and expand this foliage. There we go. Oh, what? More pollen, I think. It says free. Who's saying hello? Oh, you little bug again. Oh, I have to feed you leaves. Okay, now it's starting to get busy. So now, as we're gaining more moths, we have more things to do. So we have the pollen. Let's go get you. Oh, you're maxed out. Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh, we can expand our forest. Okay, I don't want to... I don't... Leave me alone, owl. I don't want to. Okay, well, we upgraded. <laughs> All right, so let's feed our, our little buddy here and let's expand this one. Do we have enough? Yeah, we should have enough coins. So let's go ahead and clear that up. Oh, we don't have enough. Interesting. We should now. Clear? No. That's fine. I don't need your money. Let's feed our little caterpillar. Where's our little hello person? This game, I can see where it's gonna start getting pretty busy. I just wanna see all the variety. Well, not all, because there's a lot. But I need, I need to see enough variety. Let's hatch a new egg. Hopefully we get something that's a little bit more rare. All right, are you ready to grow? Okay, so we have two more of you. Go and get this pollen and go and get this pollen. There you go. Fuse moths to raise their level. How do you do that? Okay, press on the moth and click fuse. This one. Okay, okay. All right, go get some more pollen. All right, what? We're not getting new moths? Another one? I'm gonna keep going until I find something new. Much later. All right, so now we finally have a new shiny egg. Will you be something nice? New species, what are you? You do be cute though. Let's move you over here and feed you and let's get the pollen going. And, whoa, nope, that's not what I wanted to do. And then get them pollen. There you go. Get more pollen going. So we basically just have to make the sure the flowers are good, feed the caterpillars, collect the coins from the big butterfly, well, the big moths, and then there's tiny bugs that appear like the one on the bottom right here. We just press on it and you get coins. So I do have a lot of coins. I'll figure it out later. Oh, let's summon another egg. Let's do that. Feed the little one, take care of the big ones. Are we gonna get a shiny egg? Get the pollen going. Okay, we're leveling up here. That's pretty good. 
Get your get your stuff. And we're level we're still leveling up here. All right, so it's going to take 6 seconds for the other one to grow so we can finally see what it actually looks like. And the other egg is not is not a shiny. We're not going to hurt you. Okay, let's see what it looks like. What are you going to be? Be something cool. What are you? Coffee? What? A hawk moth. Coffee clear wing. Ooh, that's cute. Very cute. What's a snare do? No, we're not doing any of that in social media things. All right, now we, we be collecting coins. We be getting some... Oh gosh, this this screen is annoying. I don't want that. I just want to get my pollen. Get my pollen, please. I have to say though, I did have great expectations from this game because it is absolutely beautiful. But I'm going to go ahead and say that this is a very long-winded game. They tried to make it so that it's busy and complex when a game like this doesn't need to be. It just needs to be relaxing and fun. Because the background music is absolutely gorgeous, the sound effects and the ambiance is beautiful, the art is gorgeous, the game itself does not deliver. So I'm gonna have to say for me, this game is just too long-winded and a dumpster fire. If you want to watch more dumpster fire games, make sure you click up here. If you want to catch a live stream that you may have missed, make sure you click down here. Until then, I will see Trash Bands next dumpster fire game!